Hello everybody, I am Nate, this is Nader Games, and we are here with Chroma. This is a demo of a first-person exploration game, I think. It's it's more, it's a dark, choose-a-door kind of game from what I got of it. Um, you have a set of hallways, and you have a set of clues, and then you have to choose the appropriate door based on the clues, but it's in pitch black, and there might be a monster? I'm really not completely sure. Obviously, I don't look into things, because I like the surprise. So, I just don't. Welcome to the demo. All you have to do is follow the lamps and go through the doors. Simple. Right? Okay, except I don't see... Can I turn on the lamps? Or do I, is this my door? Uh... Okay. Well, I can't get up there. Okay, well, now what? Welcome to the demo. All you have to do is go through, follow the lamps, go through the door. Simple, right? Well, apparently not too simple. Oh, there, okay. Jeez, it is massively dark. But wait, there's a twist. There are many different doors with different colors. How do you know which color to choose? The next note will tell you. Okay. Use your surroundings to figure out what color door to go with. If there's an object that stands out, it might be the color to choose. Good luck. Remember the paintings? No! I don't. Where were their paintings? Go backwards. Uh, there's no paintings, sir. No, oh, okay. Very, very subtle. So we'll take blue. Because the paintings are blue. Yay, I didn't die. Oh, 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 choices. I don't like choices. There was one strange looking lamp here. I wonder where it was. I don't know. I don't see a strange looking lamp. Oh, 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 that way. Hmm, echoes are really good. So you solved the first puzzle, I see. Good job. This time, it will be much harder. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Choices. Choices! Oh, there's no note there. Oh, there's no note. Oh. Green. Hint. Hint. So let's go back this way, and then we'll go to our right. See if there's a door over here. A green door. Nothing down this path. Go back to where you came from. I don't want to. That seems misleading. See, there's a note. There is too something down here. I told you there was nothing here. You should give up now. Oh, okay. Well, there is nothing there. Fair enough. Just my light. It's shining right in my face. Ah, that's better. So, I didn't remember seeing any doors. But I don't know that I come... Yeah, this is the one that said strange looking lamp. I wonder where it was. So... Was there anything that way? No. So let's go this way. So it's got to be down this way. With the no note area. Green. But I don't see... Anywhere else to go. I get it. Green lamp. Is that the sound of a door opening somewhere? 
I'm very confused. Because I heard that deep rumble sound. I don't hear it for a while, but then I come back down here to the green lamp, and I'll hear it again. See, there it goes. I'm behind the lamp. So, see, this is my this is my problem when when games are this damn dark. Ah, another green lamp, and nowhere to go. Or did I go? No, I got myself all turned around. This is the problem when games are this damn dark, and I and I know what they're going for. It's it's supposed to be hard, but when you literally can't see your surroundings, it is way too easy to get lost. And I think that takes a lot out of the experience, personally. Told you there was nothing down here. You should just give up now. So this is obviously the direction I want to go. Oh, it wouldn't be here otherwise. I'm hugging the wall, see if I go through a hidden passage. Like that! Use your heart, your heart, you're a hard head. Again, there's nothing here. I don't believe you anymore. Dark ass hallway, here I come. There we go. Man, green door. All right, single solitary lamp. Oh, I see you made it past the second level. I'm glad this is only a demo. You are good. Is that it? Backwards, oh, found a hallway. There we go. Watch out for fake notes. If the note does not use one of the keywords, it might be fake. One of the keywords? Notes with the keywords can also be fake. If they reference an object that's not in the level, they are fake. Huh. Well, okay. Let's see a fake one. There was a weird coin around here somewhere. Maybe you could find it. Hey, 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 hey. Where'd everybody go? Alright, that was the one I just read. So let's do some, some backwards here. This reminds me of a game, I never played it, but a couple big YouTubers played it, where you had to go backwards through everything. I love that painting. Blue is my favorite color. Isn't that fantastic? So blue is my hint right this second, unless that was a fake note. Choose the wrong door and you restart the entire game. Uh You won't get past this level. I made sure there are a lot of doors. There's that coin. Remember the word keywords weird, a strange color, and remember. Weird, a strange color, and remember. Okay. And there's no blue door. Holy crap! Oh, there's two shades of blue. Um, it was this one. Right? Uh, shit. <laughs> weird. Remember the keywords weird, a strange color, and remember. Hmm. I don't think, off the top of my head, those don't have any, any similarities. Weird, a strange color, and remember. Well, I'm pretty sure it's this blue door. Was I right? So you solved the first puzzle I see. Ah, oh, man. So it did. It restarted me back to the beginning. 
But that's okay. That's Chroma, and this is just a demo, so I would imagine that was probably the last level. Uh, I see promise in this. My, my issue is I don't like games that are so dark that you have to rely on walk, <clears throat> walking backwards and hugging the wall just to find out where you're going. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I know that's part of the point, but it also makes it just a touch frustrating too, and that takes out of the experience. Not that this is a story-driven, you know, uh, deep game or anything like that, but there's still an experience to be had. And if you're fumbling around in the dark trying to even see a wall, I think that takes a little out of it. Maybe brighten it up a little bit, enough to at least see walls. That's my thought. But that's Chroma. Uh, it, I, I see promise in this. I hope it goes somewhere. I hope it gets played. It's a really cool premise. If you liked it, give me a like. If not, let me know why. And if you want to see more games like this, definitely give me a subscribe and don't forget to share. Uh, but for now, I am Nate, this is Nader Games. I will see you in the future.